What's up, y'all? Welcome to Jigging with Jason. Today, I'm going to do a little backyard boogie. Because uh, the, the, the plague doctor is down right now. I got to get it painted and new seats and all that kind of stuff. So, I'll be taking y'all through a journey on there with me. But, uh, yeah, I'm going in the backyard and do a little purse jerking this morning. It's early in the morning, about 7 o'clock. We got rain the rest of this week, so I might as well take advantage of this while I can. So, give me one second. I'm going to show y'all how close I am. So, you ready to head out the back door? Got my old rod and reel. Got my boy Apollo right there. Oh, grab this. My bucket and the cricket. Close the door. Oh, yeah. So... Right here. This how far I got to go. Get to the lake. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. So put this in the boat. Put this in there. And uh, the lake has really been we had to get the lake sprayed because the lilies had taken over. And as you can see, they're turning brown. So every day, somebody along the lake comes out and uh, gets a garbage bag and fill it up with the with the weeds and throw them away. But let me get on this water. Give me a second. I'll be right back. So we're pushing off from the dock, right on the water. Put a paddle right over here to my my little spot. And I know where they at, you know what I'm saying? Like, I know where they at. Now watch this. Let me show y'all how good. Now, I ain't go too far. Because I know they right over here. So, get my hook and stuff ready. And today, I'm using my H2OX Angler. Which is... Oh, uh, you know, nice little rod and reel so far. Use it a couple of times, and you know I got that old Mr. Crap ass uh, reel with six pound test on it. Toss over there. Don't wait for it to go down. Stay tuned. Got one, y'all. Feel like a pretty decent one, and it is nice bluegill early this morning you know nice bluegill too and i'm fishing about three feet deep for them look y'all we're right back there got another nice one. Oh, this is a nice one here real nice look at that nice one and uh, i'm using a uh, number four if I get this boy out of there, show y'all what I'm using. Messing up everything. <laughs> nice one, you know. So I'm using a long shank number four hook. That's what I'm using. And uh, I got weight on there. And all I'm doing is tossing over by that dock. I'm finna see if I can show y'all this. Like right there. And we're hitting there right there. Now I just go bloop. Presto mesto disappeario. Let's see, there you go, you're running with it. Uh, got him. Got him, he was trying to run with it. He's a running, he's a track star. Oh, that's a little juvenile. <laughs> that's a little juvenile, y'all. Little bitty babe, I'm throwing back to the nursery. You know, he... Out here unsupervised. Got my cricket down here. I'm gonna show y'all how I make my crickets last. I take that cricket like this, come through that collar, go all the way out the out the, the bone hole. Here. And uh fishing over towards this dock over here. So <clears throat> show y'all. And it's early. It's about 7.30 this morning. 
Oh man, Lewis probably walking around getting ready to get his coffee because that's his dock. Just give it a couple of little jiggles. Hit then, pull it up, and guess look at that. Didn't even see it move, and they, they took my they took my bait. <laughs> Ain't that about nothing. So you get you another fresh cricket. Put it on now. Put it on now, just like that. See, he be wiggling when he in the water. So take it and watch this. Don't take long for them to hit when they hungry. But we got, like I said, we got rain for the next couple of days. So I'm trying to, you know, get my fishing in while I can. Couple of little jiggles and down goes Frazier. Come on, take it. Take it. Mm, playing with it. Ain't too hungry. <laughs> Oh, here you go. Oh, yeah, it's a good one here, y'all. A real good one. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. Nice big fat one. That's what I'm talking about. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. Got another backyard boogie action going on. Nice one, too. Big fat one. In the bucket. Ooh, ooh. This another, oh Lord. I guess it'd be the buoyancy of the water to make them feel like they're kind of big, but hey, he's a keeper, you know? Can't complain about that. <laughs> so yeah, like I said, I'm just casting over in front of that dock, you know, waiting for it to go down. But I want to say thank you to Everybody who likes, subscribe, and share my channel, I couldn't do this without y'all. It almost got to the point where I was ready to give up, but looking at my buddy, Mr. Go Get Him, you know, he let me, he lets me know anything is possible, you know, and I, I commend my brother, you know, because he's a real good friend of mine, and, you know, he, he just tells me every day, hey, bro, look, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, you go get them, you know, but, you know, it's, it's people in the fishing circle that make this possible, you know, because it's a blessing to be out on the water. But they got some who are less fortunate to be on the water, you know, and, you know, they might just enjoy a quick little video or something, you know, so that's why I keep doing it. But like I said, once again, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. You know, I'm up to 840. I'm trying to get to a thousand. You know, get a couple of sponsorships from anybody. I don't care who it is. It could be Dawn dishwashing detergent, showing how I clean my hands. You know, I got some some good ones in the bucket. You know, nice little fold. It's peaceful and quiet out here. That's why I do it, for the peace. And the, and the thump, you know, I can't, I can't lie, I love the thump. That, that, that good old thump when they take it down, you know? It ain't too hot. Temperature just right. Been a minute, but I got another bite. Nice one too. Big nice bluegill. Look at that. Right down. Yes, sir. Uh, bag up from this spot. See if I can catch a few right here. Good one. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that little chunky pin. Ha <laughs> ha, yes sir. 
Let's go. Nice little chinky pin, too. Or shell crack, as they call them up north. Oh, yeah. Nice one. Real nice one. Well, y'all, that's gonna do it for me today. Came and made a little short trip, caught six. I'm good with that. I ain't wanna keep all of them today, no way, but as you can see, the lily started to move back in, so it'd be hard for me to paddle through there. But, you know, hey, it is what it is. I enjoyed myself as always. So, you know, I'll be glad when all this stuff gone, we had somebody come and treat it. But, you know, until next time, keep the comments coming, keep sharing, keep you know doing everything y'all doing i love y'all i appreciate y'all thanks for the support shout out to my boy mr go get him at go get him tv like i say if it wasn't for that brother i would have gave up you know my bar Armand, you know my partner greg you know everybody that i fish with who told me to keep pushing you know what i'm saying so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna keep pushing and one of these days i will be successful please believe me you know what i'm saying they say speak and you shall receive you know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm doing. I'm speaking my professionalism on YouTube, TikTok, whatever, you know, formats may come up that I will be successful. Until next time, love y'all. Appreciate you. Stay blessed. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button so, you know, you get that notification every time it pop up. Right now, I'm going to go take these boys to 1305 <coughs> Hot Skillet Drive. Later.